Okay, so I had a little request for uh, for a tutorial on how to make this uh, geothermal generator um, infinite lava system with lava cells. So I'm going to quickly do it. I'm not going to do too much talking. Just maybe tell you what I'm doing as I'm doing it, and that's about it. So, so these are geothermal generators. I'll do five of them. Ten of them, rather. an MFSU because uh, well high high voltage electricity is the way to go that's why okay so I'm gonna dig out underneath So now we're going to use advanced insertion pipes and uh, toss those on here. transport pipe okay so then you right click on that you want these two I don't know, blue and teal which is these two to be one and everything else to be zero so that'll send one down there one down there as they come down Pipe. Now we'll do a wood pipe. Just a regular wooden pipe. Put our energy condenser. Put another one here. Okay. Dig this out. Put redstone engines all around.
right here. I'll put an advanced insertion pipe. So it'll always try and go in there first. And then once it can't fit in there anymore, it'll go into here to make red matter. And that will pump into this chest. another energy collector or two and you could put them on here temporarily to heat the system up to get these things full really quickly but I don't care enough ah sure I'll show you I'll show you But just by adding a couple of these to the energy condenser, you can heat the system up nice and quick. Oops. Our watch. You could even heat it up more using uh, energy relays. So you put a relay and then you put a couple of these energy collectors onto the relay. And it all relays back into the energy condenser. And that's it. So, uh, yeah, if you have any other questions, just post a couple of comment and uh, I'll try and answer them. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye.